So today we're going to be talking about the Pratt Knot, and the Pratt Knot is also called the Shelby Knot. It's one of the more modern knots and is quite popular right now. Start with the tie inside out with the wide end on the right about 12 inches longer than the narrow end on the left. Cross the wide end under the narrow end towards the left, then loop it up and down through the back. then tighten it. With your right hand, create a little bridge over the knot. Wrap the wide end around to the right, down, and then up through the back of the knot, and then down through the knot in front. Hold the knot carefully and holding the back narrow side, slide the tie up towards the neck. And there you have a Pratt knot. The Pratt knot generally works quite well for everyone, but it works particularly well for somebody with a medium build or medium bone structure. It also works very well for a tie that is medium to wide in width in a light to medium fabric and works well with most dress shirts. The Shelby knot is actually a very interesting knot because it is more modern, as I said, but a lot of men actually find it quite awkward. And once you've tied it, you'll notice that the narrow end is actually inside out at the back. But once you get the hang of the knot, it is actually a really easy knot. Another complaint that men have is that it's the only knot that comes off with a knot, so you have to untie it after you take it off. For a little polish or just for fun, be brave and try a different tie knot. You may be pleasantly surprised by the response you get.